Uh, so we'll go last group of the tournament, Group H. Uh, the favourites, of course, are Germany, who we mentioned before, $1.05 to win the group. Then you've got Colombia, $13 to win the group. South Korea, $21, so pretty close there. Morocco, $151 to win the group. Then Germany, $1.02, clear favourites to qualify. Uh, Colombia, $1.66 to qualify. South Korea, just behind them, $1.90 to qualify. And Morocco, $41 to qualify. This is actually a pretty strong group as well. Yeah, this is another one where it's like, all right, Germany, top the group, go through. Simple as that. Yep. But then it's like both Germany and the Korea Republic will both be going, all right, our expectation of this World Cup is to qualify for their knockouts because yep. that's sort of the way both teams are looking at uh, their profile as well, what, what you expect. And Morocco, despite their odds, they recently drew with Italy and Switzerland. So they're Ooh, okay. not, you can't they're right, just yeah. walk straight through them. Mm. Uh, but it's pretty simple. Germany are probably my value better. Than, I, I know I was talking about tipping England yesterday. If I'm having bets on teams to win the tournament, I'm back in Germany or England. Yeah, I'm back in England. And you, yeah, they're I don't the mind Germany as well. They're the yeah. two teams I want to back. Yep. Um, Qualification for this tournament, Germany scored, Germany got 27 of a possible 30 points. They scored 47 goals and conceded five. So that's scary good. Yeah, yeah. They're $8.50, by the way, to win the whole thing, ooh, which is really good ooh, value could compared get to your US yeah. uh, $3.50. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not on the America, backing America to win this. Uh, but So Alexandra uh, Pop, she's one of the best players in the world. She's a freak. She's Absolutely awesome, done. Yeah. Um, I've Just, you know, because obviously we don't know as much about the women's game as we do the men. So I've been watching highlights on like YouTube and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Man, if she tackled me, I'd be in hospital. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, she is physical. She's strong, yeah. Oh, yeah. she is so physical. So she missed the finals in the Euros through an injury. Germany probably win the Euros if she plays, I reckon. Like, that's how big yeah, her okay. not playing is. Uh, she scored a goal in every group match. She scored a goal in the quarterfinal and the semifinal of the Euros. That shows you how important she is to this German team. Yep. If she gets a run on sort of like what Messi did at the World Cup, good luck stopping Germany. Yep. That's all I'm saying. Uh History for the Germans is quite simple. Played in every World Cup. They've won it in the past. They should breeze through this group. Top the group. What price were they to top the group? Uh, I was pretty short. Yeah. Let me just double check. Dollar like oh five. No. But, <laughs> no. Okay. Don't. But a bit of value there. I did write about the golden boot. Alexandra Pop was $13. Yeah. So I think she's yeah. one of my value Ooh, that picks for that. that. So that's a pretty good bet there as well. Yeah. So this is where it gets interesting for me is for Colombia and Korea Republic. So it's the third World Cup that Colombia have played in. They lost to Brazil. This is Colombia I'm talking about. Lost to Brazil in the yep. Copper America. They knocked off Argentina in the semifinals. Ooh, okay. Uh, they've never got past the group stage, but then you have a look. Linda Sacedo, not related to Mo Moises, different countries of birth. So right. before people <laughs> get confused, there's someone's, I saw someone on Twitter say, going, oh, I wonder if Moses is going to support Linda. And then someone's like, dude, They're not from the same country, yeah. Like, <laughs> How could, they cannot be related. <laughs> well, they could be, but just, you know. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so she made her national team debut at 14. 14? Yep. She scored, two, she scored two goals during the Copper America and she plays for Real Madrid right now. So mm. she's the one to look out for for them. That's awesome. Uh, Korea Republic are a former round of 16 qualifier. Uh, that was in 2015. It's their fourth World Cup in France. They lost all three of their group matches, which Ooh. was a big shock. You look at their consistent uh, at inter uh, sorry, their consistency at international level. They've won two of five this year. They lost to England, Belgium, and Italy. So that's like, okay, you're not – that level, but yeah, then not again, at the top level, yeah. At a tournament, it depends. Like uh, Li Guanmin, she scored five goals in two matches in April, which is what two games that they won. Yep. And you go back, it's like, oh, when she gets in, she scores. So if Korea have a chance of progressing through to the knockout, she's probably going to have to score four or five goals in the group stages. Um, shout out to Morocco. They're probably going to run last in this group. Yep. First Arab team ever yeah, to play I saw the World that. Cup. That's, a, that's an awesome effort. That's yeah. awesome. They lost to South Africa in that um, African Cup of Nations final. Uh, look, not a hope of winning a tournament, but getting a point or a win sort of would be awesome. That's what we get here. Uh, the experience of World Cup, again, invaluable to them. But having a look sort of few of the futures of this, I think one of my best bets of the tournament is Germany to make the quarterfinals at $1.60. Okay, yeah. And like Korea it. Republic is who I'm saying is going to qualify through to the uh, knockouts at $1.90. $1.90, yeah, yeah, that's good. I think they get past Colombia. Past Colombia, yeah. yeah. So that matchup, yeah, Colombia, South Korea would be awesome to watch. Yeah, yeah that's yeah, okay. it. Are we going to, is the Korea Republic game here in Melbourne? I can't remember. Is I'm it Germany sure. and Korea? I think. It might be actually. Oh, check. Morocco definitely is. I'm going to check my, yeah, I think it's Morocco. Going Morocco. I'm going Morocco yeah. and Germany. Damn it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that'll be exciting. Anyway. That'll that's still be right. good, yeah. Uh, but cheer yeah. on Morocco. <laughs> yeah. I'll cheer on Germany. I'm going to, I'm going to. if you have money on Germany. I'm going to have a wager on Germany. I think, yeah, through all of this, as we've gone through all the groups, my wager in this is going to be to back the Germans to win the tournament. Okay. Yeah. I just, I don't, I like them. Like, yeah, I think I think the Experience, Euros form, the Euros yeah. form is the best form. I think uh, obviously love for Australia to win, but you know, 
Yeah, I think it'll, it'll struggle, but we still could. Yeah, yeah the former in. But it's almost like you have a look at it, and do you really want to get like we can? If you go have a look, and all the expected favorites win all their groups that yep. you think they should. If Germany finished second in their group, or England for that yeah, matter, yeah, it makes it tough, doesn't it? No, yeah. no, it makes it easy oh, for them. They really? get up in that other half of the group, okay? Because Germany, and England have to play each other in the. Sorry, Gerald, uh, just smack the microphone. They have to play <laughs> each other in the quarterfinals. Yep. And then, then uh, the winner of that would probably more than likely, if Australia go through, play Australia. So a tactical in the semis. second, do you think? Oh, a tactical <laughs> second could lose be your last. Well, fans can come and play for England. Germany well, if they last win game. their first two, it's like, okay, what you know, who, who the, uh, figure out what you know the results of the bracket could be. It's like, hey, if we finish second, like it's yeah. a tactical loss or a tactical draw. Ah, you got to try get and in, finish first. Yeah, but to, to get into the easier half of the bracket, <laughs> like. Uh, I well, like a I bit of skullduggery. Yeah, yeah. If it happens, I'm going to say yeah, 18th nuts. of July. <laughs> but yeah, no, I think, yeah, of all the teams, I, I love that Germany to, uh, to, yeah, to I win like the Germany. tournament. But I think, my, yeah, my best bet out of this whole thing would be Argentina at 4 bucks 33 to qualify through nice. to the uh, yeah, okay. knockouts. I don't mind that. What are you really gambling with? For free and confidential support, call the number on the screen or visit the website.